Hey everybody, welcome back. It's time for another episode of Game of Thrones. I'm going to be watching episode number three from season number three. We didn't see any of Daenerys in episode number two, so I'm expecting... Well, I probably shouldn't expect anything. I'm hoping that we'll see some of her story in this episode. And we just kind of touched on Theon's story a little bit, so I want to see a little bit more about what's going on with him. He's being held captive and he's being tortured, and I'm not quite sure we know who is holding him captive yet. So I'm interested to find out a little bit more there. And also Bran. He's on the road with a couple of strangers, and they seem to know him. And, they, and the boy seems to know that Bran can put himself somehow into animals and into his wolf. And he knew the wolf. And he knows about the three-eyed raven. So there's some interesting storylines going on that I'm hoping we get a little bit more information on. And of course the hound recognized Arya. So what's going to happen to her now? Definitely some interesting storylines going on. But before I get to the episode, let me ask you to please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload new episodes. And also please comment down below and let me know your insights into these episodes. But please don't give any spoilers. I want to see it as it happens. So let's get started with the episode. Well, another thing that I'm interested in learning a little bit more about is the storyline up at the wall and with John Sad as well. Of course, I'm interested in learning about all of the different storylines. But they touch on different stories so quickly and so briefly in some of the episodes that I don't quite get enough. I, w I want to get a little bit more. Oh, I almost forgot about Brienne and Jamie and the situation they find themselves in. So a lot of stories going on, very, very fluid episodes. You're going to miss again? <laughs> Take his hand when he laid him across that stump the way he did with his hand outstretched like that. Wasn't quite sure maybe he would take some fingers or not, but... I just had a feeling he was going to lose his hand. I was hoping to get a little bit of Bran and, and Rickon's story in this episode, but I guess we'll see some of that next time. And with Daenerys, I, I don't believe she's going to give up one of her dragons. Of course, there's a lot of things that happen in this series that you would not believe is going to happen, and then it happens. So we'll have to wait and see if, if that's really going to take place. But like I said during that segment, she wants all of those soldiers, and they're supposed to be sworn to do everything she says. So what if she turns them against the city she just bought them from and takes the dragon back? And who was that that rescued Theon? Well, I guess I'll find that out in a future episode. So I'm looking forward to episode four. I'll probably watch that in the next couple of days. So stick around, subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell. And like I said, please leave some comments down below and let me know your thoughts about this episode and the episodes that came before it. And hit that thumbs up also and that will help my channel to grow. I'll see you on the next episode.